Greetings folks, uh, I'm out again with the Reptile Dragon Talon uh, doing some stall testing. I've done some mods to it, uh, I have basically ripped out everything inside, everything unnecessary including the ball link, um, push rods, anything that adds unnecessary weight I've, I've pulled it out just to try and lighten it as much as possible. I think in the configuration that I've got now it's about 100 grams lighter. Um, I've taken the uh, power distribution board out, taken the LEDs out, everything uh, that I could to save weight. And I'm also using a 1300 3S right up in the nose. That actually puts the CG back behind the, um, the little uh, bumps a little bit, which some people suggested might help. Um, it means I, I can use less up trim on the elevator. Uh, so uh, it is flying a lot nicer, but it still does drop a wing when it stalls, but uh, it's a lot less likely to stall. Anyway, let's go for a fly and show you uh, how it flies. So it does fly a lot slower now. And it doesn't uh, give you those surprise snap stalls in the slow corners. If you deliberately try and stall it, it will drop a wing. But that's flying beautifully slowly now. Slow and efficient. So even with that light uh, 1300-3S battery, it's going to have a pretty decent flight time. So let's try and stall it anyway. Slowing down, pulling back. There we go. See it dropped the wing, but it could recover it. So that's that's okay. That's much better as a lighter plane. This is this is sort of the weight it should be, even lighter. So I think uh, if you modded it and gave it a longer nose, so you could put a lighter battery right up in the nose, it's going to be much nicer to fly. But I'm not worried about uh, flying slowly, doing slow turns or anything like that anymore that if you do deliberately stall it it's going to get you into trouble let's try a loop anyway power up a bit Whee, look at that that one wing let go so definitely uh, got problems with the airfoil and the wingtip design something's Bit of a design failure, I think. Here it goes again. Look at that. Crazy. Whee, there you go. Whee, that just let go. Okay, still got problems. Uh, bit of a design failure, I think. What would I do to fix it? I think, um, I think I would cut those wing tips off, maybe extend the wings. Uh, add something to the trailing edge just to give it a little bit more wing area but um, that is uh, not behaving well so you can see the little 1300 3s in there and no flight uh, no power distribution board just the um, wire lead for the motors okay so <laughs> still having problems let's let's try a few more what I'm going to do is pull these wing tips off that's something I can try out in the field I wonder if they're it's going to be give it some ugly wing tips but Maybe these are causing more problems than they are supposed to fix. Let's see. Maybe they put the wing tips on because they're having so many problems. Feels good so far. Let's try a stall. Uh -huh, it's uh, a bit more of a benign stall. Still drops the wing, but not so radical. Let's try a loop. 
Uh, still does a uh, corkscrew instead of a loop. See if we do a uh, slow turn stall. There we go. That was definitely okay. I'm calling it. Uh, not a good plane. Uh, I wouldn't recommend it. Needs some mods to the wings and airfoil, I think. Oh well, this is fun. Thanks for watching.